let's explore the world of honeybees, Tommy. Honeybees are small flying insects that play a big role in nature. They live in colonies and work together to build a hive. Tommy, do you know inside the hive there are worker bees, drones, and the queen bee? Tommy worker bees gather nectar, drones help in reproduction, and queen lays eggs. Have you seen bees dancing, Tommy? Bees dance to share information about the location of food with other members of the hive. Bees help plants make new seeds by carrying pollen from one flower to another. Did you know, Tommy, that one-third of the food we eat depends on pollinators like bees? Worker bees collect nectar, bring it back to the hive, and turn it into honey through a fascinating process. Do you know Tommy bees face challenges like pesticides and habitat loss? We can help by planting bee-friendly flowers and avoiding harmful chemicals. Do you know honeybees are amazing creatures that help our environment and provide us with delicious honey? Okay, Tommy, listen carefully. How bees make honey? Worker bees leave the hive to search for flowers that produce nectar. They use their long proboscis to extract the sweet liquid from the flowers. Dear Tommy, the worker bee stores the collected nectar in a special stomach, separate from its regular digestion stomach. Enzymes in the honey stomach begin to break down complex sugars in the nectar. The worker bee returns to the hive with the collected nectar in its honey stomach. Upon returning, the forager bee passes the nectar to other worker bees through a process called trophallaxis. The bees inside the hive receive the nectar and spread it in thin layers within the honeycomb cells. By fanning their wings, the bees facilitate the evaporation of water from the nectar, making it thicker. Now, Tommy, the nectar undergoes further enzymatic changes during the ripening process. The enzymes convert sucrose in the nectar into simpler sugars like glucose and fructose. Once the nectar is ripened into honey, the worker bees cap the honeycomb cells with beeswax to seal the honey inside. The honey serves as a vital food source for the hive during the winter when there are fewer flowers and less nectar available. Now, Tommy, remember, it's the incredible teamwork and communication among the worker that make this process possible. I hope you enjoyed buzzing along with me on this Honey Bay adventure. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more fun and educational videos. Until next time, stay curious.